Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm making another smoothie with a different set of ingredients I've never used before. So this is obviously the faster pace, but again, it took me around five minutes to 10 minutes for this one because there were a couple of ingredients here. So I had mango, papaya, um, guava, the usual protein powder, peanut butter, chai seeds, and um, what you call this, cashews and then some bananas so there's a lot of rich uh, fruits in here but it was quite thick in size as you could have seen the it was almost full to capacity basically um, but it was so delicious so as you can see here I'm already done putting in the in the glass and yeah and I topped it with a couple of granola which was a little just to add a little taste and then obviously we are finished so guys again smoothies are good breakfast replacement bye welcome to the slow motion so this is the normal pace so start with the ice and I love to put some ice it's hot right now in South Africa so having a little bit of ice in the smoothie really makes it a bit not a bit it makes it a lot more colder which is what I want and then I had some almond milk and then the papai which is a frozen papai had one uh, glass in yeah and then mango which I normally do use and guava the papa and guava look the same but they're not and then the banana which was getting ripe so that's why I wanted to use it to be honest I uh, wouldn't have used it because I already had a lot of things going there and then I had a teaspoon of chai seeds and a half a teaspoon and then I had some cashews, not so much. Cashews are quite rich, but they're a good source of protein. And then protein powder, just about the three teaspoons there. And then I had a scoop of a teaspoon of peanut butter. So I normally use a spoon, so I think I'm gonna reduce it to a teaspoon. And then a bit of water, just to make sure that it does blend. So this time around it did take me some time because these were a lot of ingredients so I had to kind of fight with the blender so as you can see it's just going on and on but yeah it took a while because I had a lot of things going so normally when the blender is looking like it's stuck I pause it and then I just take a spoon I squashed all the ingredients so I keep on checking up on it until it starts blending everything according to plan so it took quite some time here as you can see and then finally the ingredients all blended together look at that this is what I want to see so I have it I'm having this for supper so you can choose supper lunch dinner or oh, dinner supper it's the same thing or lunch so this time I had overnight oats for what's this I had overnight oats for breakfast so this is what I'm having now for dinner yay yay so thank you guys again for just really Taking better care of yourself, choosing to use the right set of ingredients, choosing health over quick food, you know, and really this is the reason why I'm sharing this with you because I'm, I love creating these smoothies, it's fun for me, it's not, it doesn't take a lot of effort, so I hope you do enjoy it. 